Welcome back to another review, another Hidden Side set, this time from the Series 1, as I say, uh, of Hidden Side. This is the Shrimp Shack box, very large box, it's quite detailed, as always, and then on the back shows you the app and, uh, you know, what, what the thing does. And again, we have all of the characters on the top there. Instruction manual, it's quite a thick instruction manual for this one, and five bags, five set bags there. Um, some of them quite large, but again, nice, clear, simple instructions, and just pass this to the back. One sticker sheet as well, which is good. In my eyes, I think maybe if they do release more, say a season three of Hidden Side sets, maybe they could start using more printed pieces that might make it a bit more appealing and look a bit better. Your spare parts, you get one spare head, as we'll see with the woman on top, as you can see the woman up top there, that's meant to be her head. Oh, you get two spare heads, sorry. Um, obviously the chef down there as well. Uh, you get some spare sort of kitchen parts, maybe a hot dog there, or a blade, and like a scoop, and some dials in there, which always come in handy. So the set, we have the shrimp shack here, and the car, Jack's little car. We'll start with the car. Quite basic, this cannon of as such on the uh, on the front there. Jack's got his stern face on in there, but there is two faces to him. It's quite nice there, if I must say. So now for the big shrimp shack. It is pretty cool this one, pretty detailed. You have the figures here, you've got Parker, obviously standard Parker, Parker figure there. You've got a little Spencer I've put down here, the chef in his evil form. You have to add this extra sort of torso piece and it comes with a nice sort of yellowish green uh, meat cleaver as well there. Again, this girl, she's obviously the waiter, uh, waitress. She's got her cup on a tray there. She's in her evil form as well as I put all my evil forms on. And we have Ronnie, the customer, with his hot dog. Stuffing his face with his hot dog. He's quite good. So now let's have a proper look at this, the building. The building's quite nice. Um, you have this little mechanism down here, which lets you open and close the, uh, the teeth, the ghoul teeth there. Also, you can move it apart. And I, I think this is meant to represent like lava uh, as such, the floor breaking apart, lava there. Um, you've got your staircase here. The shutters, they close, open and close, uh, which is quite good. And your little shrimp, it moves. I haven't played the app with this one either, so I'm not too sure if that comes interactive. Now if we spin it round, you see we have the eye here which spins round, so you can have the eye facing out, or the, the, the clock, the name. Uh, you got one moving barrel up here. Um, I'm not too sure why it moves or if it moves properly but it turns this, meant to turn this sort of underneath the grill around there. And also the uh, interactive colours on this one, they're in quite a hidden place which is quite strange in my eyes. They are here. You can see you have to get your finger right in there to turn the colours. Um, welcome to leave comments um, to say if I've built this wrong maybe, um, but maybe this is meant to connect up all, all of them, I'm not sure, but um, I followed the instructions and couldn't get that to work. Uh, here 
You've got lots of spare fish, an egg in there. Uh, and that's really all about it with this hidden side set. Um, very good build, easy build, pretty straightforward. And uh, I'm assuming it's going to be lots of fun on the app. So yeah, thanks for watching.